Cochlear implant is a specialized hearing device to restore hearing to patients who have severe to profound hearing loss. The procedure begins by performing a mastoidectomy accomplished by removing the hollow bone behind the ear. After making an incision and retracting the ear forward to expose the mastoid bone surface, the honeycomb partitions of the mastoid bone are then drilled away down to where it connects into the middle ear. There are important structures that are preserved during the procedure including semicircular canals responsible for inner ear balance, the bone that separates the brain from the mastoid cavity, the sigmoid sinus which is a large blood vessel, the corda tympani nerve which supplies sense of taste to the tongue, the facial nerve which is responsible for facial movements. The round window is where the implant will be inserted. Once the round window is exposed, a well along with a channel are then drilled into the skull upon which the implant is seated. The electrode array is then inserted into the round window and gently threaded into the cochlea. The skin incision is then closed. After the incision has healed, the external component of the cochlear implant can then be worn to start the process of hearing restoration. Here is a live surgery of a cochlear implantation. A minimal mastoidectomy is performed to access the middle ear. Water and suction is used to keep the surgical site clean while the bone is drilled away. The water also helps keep the area cool and prevents heat from building up which may lead to tissue damage. Here the facial recess part of the mastoid bone is being drilled away to expose the round window. At this point attention is redirected to the skull above the mastoid where a well and channel is drilled into the bone where the implant receiver will be secured. The implant is then placed such that the receiver is snugly placed into the well and the electrode within the channel. Once the implant is seated in the well, the electrode is then gently threaded through the round window into the cochlea. Once the electrode is fully inserted, tissue fragments are placed to plug the area. The rest of the electrode is allowed to coil freely within the mastoid cavity.
The ear is laid back into normal position and the skin sutured back together.